UW360 is proudly supported by Pacific Office Automation, Copy, Print, Workflow, and IT, Problem Solved. On any given day, thousands of commuters get on buses to get to work, school, and daily appointments. It's a struggle for transportation services of all sizes to determine how to best meet the needs of their riders. Established in 2012, PACTRANS is a center of transportation research, one with dual goals of safety and sustainability. This PACTRANS center will be the Region 10's transportation research engine. We also want to be a collaboration uh, platform because a lot of transportation problems are really uh, regional problems, not as specific to a, a, a city. So to address those kind of problems, we require collaboration. This consortium of five Pacific Northwest universities, including the University of Washington, has come up with a new, inexpensive way to capture rider data. University transportation research for us is largely focused on how to move people through a transportation system efficiently and safely. The focus of PACTRANS is on transportation safety, identifying places in the network that are unsafe, finding ways to address uh, those problems. We installed sensors that could record these MAC addresses or unique electronic identifiers on board transit vehicles so that we could start to understand how people are using the transit system with the hope uh, of improving the service uh, for people that are using it. As research like this moves forward and gets applied on a larger time and space scale, uh, the need for individual privacy protection is going to get even more important and that, that is a major thrust of our research. We have a, a method for converting the MAC addresses or unique identifiers into pseudo-anonymous codes that can't be linked to any particular person. PACTRANS research has already caught the attention of transit officials as far away as China and Brazil. The cost-efficient gathering of accurate transit data is a valuable tool for all transit organizations want to gather is really how many passengers get on the bus at a particular stop, how long they spend on the bus, where they get off the bus. So if these people continue their travel by transferring to a different bus, where they make the transfer, how long they waited. So all this information can be collected using this technology. And I do believe this kind of information is super important for transit operators. 